What is up, boxing fam? Sa video na to, throwback muna tayo. Balikan natin ang labang Pacquiao versus Thurman at ang mga detalye sa laban na to bago sila nagarap noong 2019. Before we get started, make sure to like and subscribe sa ating YouTube channel. Cheers! Yo! Nandiyan na naman yung kaibigan natin si Eridar Boxing TV. Pakisubscribe na po. At ano bang inaapangan nyo? Pindot na kay Eridar Boxing TV. It would be a year before Pacquiao step into the ring again. July 2018, nakaharap ni Manny Pacquiao si Lucas Matisse para sa WBA regular world welterweight title. Si Lucas ay kilala ding knuckle puncher kaya delikado ning kalaban si Matisse. This time without Freddy Roach in his corner, si Buboy ang tumayong head trainer sa laban na ito. Kitang-kita ang bagsik ni Manny sa laban na to. Sabi niya nga before the fight, he felt like 28 or 27 years old again. Pacquiao dominates Matisse, then stops him in round 7. Pacquiao scored his first knockout win since 2009. After ng laban na ito, dito na natapos ang relationship ni Manny with top rank. Pacquiao has officially signed with Al Heyman at under na siya ng PBC banner. At ayun na nga, 2019, first fight ni Manny sa PBC. Walang iba kundi si Adrian, the problem broner. At alam naman natin kung paano binigyan ni Manny ng boxing lesson si Adrian Broner. Pacquiao easily defeated Adrian Broner by a unanimous decision. Isa din sa dahilan kung bakit lumipat si Manny sa PBC ay dahil gusto niya makaharap ang mga PBC fighters sa kanyang division tulad nila Sean Porter, Danny Garcia, Keith Thurman at Errol Spence Jr. And of course, isa na din sa dahilan eh kung bakit tumalon si Manny sa PBC ay dahil gusto niyang hamunin ng rematch si Floyd Mayweather. Actually, noong 2018, nagkita ulit ang dalawa at naghint pa nga si Mayweather na lalaban siya sa December that year. At of course, dahil nandun si Manny, in-expect ng mga tao na finally, magkakarematch na nga ang dalawa. Easy work! Pero fake news pala yun. Si Tenshin na Sukawa pala ang next niyang makakalaban. Hindi makuha-kuha ni Pacquiao ang inaasam niyang rematch kay Floyd. Kaya walang choice si Manny kundi mag-move on. Usap-usapan nun ang labang Pacquiao vs. Spence Jr. Pero ang next na makakalaban ni Manny ay ang undefeated welterweight champion na si Keith Thurman. Keith, one-time Thurman. One-time. Dahil ito daw ang nagre-represent na kanyang punching power. Knockouts are what the fans want to see. Keith, one-time Thurman is a nickname that represents my punching power. It could be one time to the head, one time to the body, one time with the left, one time with the right. One time in the first round, one time in the last round. Doesn't matter. It's one time, all the time. KOs for life. Bago niya nakalaban si Pacquiao, siya ay may perfect na record. 29 wins, 0 loss, 22 knockouts. With big wins over Danny Garcia. Sean Porter. At Jose Cito Lopez. Para kay Manny, fighting a younger talented opponent, like Thurman, can turn back the clock to the glory days of 2008-2010. Manny feels like he's young again even sa kanyang edad na 40 anos. 
Nagbigay din ng mga predictions sa mga kilalang boxers sa lamang Pacquiao Thurman nagaganapin sa PBC Fox Pay-Per-View. Silang mga sumusunod. I think I'm gonna have to go with Pacquiao because he's the older, experienced guy. I have Keith Thurman winning the fight. I think he's more youthful. I think he has more power. Picking Keith Thurman to win by majority decision. Youthful overtake the experience of the great Manny Pacquiao. I think Pacquiao's gonna win because one, he has experience, the speed, and he has great power. I gotta go with the young Young Buck. I gotta go with Thurman. I think uh, Pacquiao's gonna win. His speed is aggressive. The prediction is that Thurman is gonna win because he's younger. Manny Pacquiao, he's just a legend in the sport. Draw. If I had to pick one, I'm gonna say draw. I'm gonna have to go with my man Keith Thurman. I like Pacquiao for he, Pacquiao is uh, very tough. He, for me, win, win Pacquiao. Keith Thurman is, is, it has a ton of uh, talent, power, speed. I like Keith I, I pick Manny. I think Manny wins uh, by decision. Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao? Decision. All right. Para kay Thurman, this is the moment. Beating a legend like Manny will solidify his boxing career. Sa laban nila noong July 2019 na ginanap sa Las Vegas, Nevada, dito na pinakita ni Manny na kaya niya pang makipagsabayan even at his age. Round 1 pa lang, natikman na ni Thurman ang lakas ng kamao ni Manny. Bumagsak ang kampiyon na si Thurman, pero nakasurvive ito. Nagpatuloy ang aggressive punching ni Pacquiao at ipinakita ang mabilis niyang footwork. Action-packed ang laban na to. Maganda ang palitan ng dalawang boksingero. Medyo nakabawi si Thurman sa middle rounds, landing big shots. Nakapasok ang mga right straight ni Thurman at tatamaan din si Pacquiao. Pacquiao showed that he still has the hand speed and power.
He needs this after a fight. Good luck in the first half. Thurman has got to win this half of the fight. Pero bumawi si Manny ng isang left hook to the body. Muntik na bumagsak si Thurman. Napatra si Thurman na talatang hirap ito sa paginga. Dahil sa lakas ng suntok ni Manny sa tagiliran ni Thurman. Dito na nakilala ni Thurman kung sino si Manny Pacquiao sa loob ng ring. Sa uli, panalo si Manny Pacquiao sa pamagitan ng split decision at nakuha ang WBA Welterweight Championship. Thurman suffers his first career defeat while si Pacquiao naman nag-improve ang kanyang record. Manny Pacquiao has proved once and for all that he is a GOAT. G-O-A-T, the 40-year-old Manny not only outboxed the formerly unbeaten champion Keith Thurman, but outclasses him to capture the welterweight title and became the oldest welterweight champion in boxing history.